Good morning, good afternoon, whichever time you're watching me. Welcome back to my Fado Beauty channel, my awesome Fado Beautyettes. It is day number six of Vlogmas. How's everybody doing out there? Let's eat brunch. A little too late for breakfast, a little too early for lunch. <laughs> what did I get from the store? Dun, dun, dun. Drum rolled. A chicken and parmesan. Just a little brunch. Some snackies. I got a cute little strawberry fruit Debbie cake. Look at that. Yum ski. And I got me a honey bun. Mmm. And that look good. Mm. Nice and sticky. <laughs> Hope everyone is enjoying their vlogmas thus far, especially my vlogs, especially my videos. Mmm. 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 So good. Mmm. Look at that. See all that chicken? Mmm. 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 And I got me some big red soda. Where is it? There it is. I put it in here so I don't spill it all over my laptop. <laughs> don't mind my double chin. This is not a good angle. Here we go. Thumbnail. I think that one's better. Yeah, baby. So I was planning on taking a walk to the lake, but there's too many annoying neighbors out today. It slows down a bit. There's a lot of bikers in town. I think it's Toy for Tots. We were supposed to have a gig today. I don't know what happened. Haven't heard back from the girls. Maybe it got canceled. Maybe they're too freaking stoned. And slept the day away. Who knows? Just say no. See, that's why I don't do drugs. Because those days just go by. And then before you know it, you missed a gig, right? Mmm. <laughs> so good. Good cheese. Oh, yeah. Ah. The marinara sauce. Oh, so good. Mm. So, I've been contemplating if I want to stick with these chicks or not. They're older than me. They have more experience years wise, but as far as singing with real instruments and the real bands, I don't think so. That's where I have seniority. And also, uh, I thought I can handle being around the drugs and stuff, but it makes me uncomfortable. So I decided if I'm going to sing in a band, it's going to be a real rock band with real instruments. And because what they do is karaoke parties. And basically, they sing the karaoke tracks, but with the lead vocals. And I think that's kind of lame. And I'm just not with that, you know. If you're going to do karaoke, do it the right way. Remove the lead vocals so the people can hear you sing. I don't want to have to be screaming over lead vocals when I can sing myself. Thank you very much. So scratch that idea. And I gave it a shot. I went to one rehearsal. 
I thought about it for a week and I was just like, you know what, it's not for me, it's not a real, real band, it's not what I'm used to. I'm used to like playing out and jamming with real, you know, like five piece rock bands, like guitarist, bass player, drummer, lead, backup vocals, rhythm guitars, I mean, I'm talking about, you know, like old school 80s, 90s type rock bands, but it's not just, you know, everything synthesized or on a track playing behind you on a PA system. I think that's kind of lame. It's gay. What can I say? Not that being gay is bad. Let's rephrase that. It's lame-o. So no gay-mo. If y'all know of any bands looking for a singer, hook me up. Let me know in the comments below. I live in Sebring, Florida. So if you're local to me and you know of any real bands out there looking for a real vocalist hook me up let me know I'm also looking on my own but you know it's gonna be kind of hard because I got all these side side freelance gigs on the side that's redundant I have all these <laughs> freelance gigs that I'm doing and I have a new client for my marketing and advertising business and I want to squeeze in music. You have to make room for music because it's, it's in my blood. You know what I'm saying? This channel, Fatal Beauty, is supposed to be for music. And I just like participating in different things once in a while. But you'll see every now and then I'll, I'll sing or I'll rap and I'll just throw it in the mix. <laughs> mm. Mm. Less gabbing, more eating. Mmm. So the egg. <coughs> Excuse me. So I hope everyone's doing well. Mmm. I want to take a bite of this. I haven't tried it yet. I'm so excited. My first time trying a strawberry swirl cake from Little Debbie. Mmm. You see that? Can you focus on that? Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh, that's so good. Sweet. Mm. You can really taste the strawberry. It's like a strawberry jam with a whipped cream. Oh my god, that's good. Mmm. 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 And we can't let the little cinnamon bun get jealous, so. Oh yeah. Mmm. all that sugar. I'm going to pay for this later. I did not read the ingredients, guys. I wanted to be naughty for my brunch. Not a lot of food. It's a lot of carbs. <laughs> Probably most likely gluten in there. But I'm taking my potassium and dandelion supplement. I took one this morning, so... Hopefully, that'll help throughout the day. And then I take it again in the afternoon. Mmm. Mmm. So good. Mmm. Where's my drink? <laughs> Where did I put my drink? <laughs> my drink trying to run away on me. What's up? <laughs> Oh, that chin dough. Mm. And it's gonna get worse later. After I finish eating all this. Woo! Believe it or not, I'm already getting full. I think it's all the the carbs and the sugar uh, and the chicken. It's like two chicken patties with marinara sauce and parmesan. 
melted mozzarella. And then the Little Debbie has whipped cream with strawberry jam. And then you know what a cinnamon bun is, right? It's <laughs> cinnamon with um, yummy frosting. Carbs, carbs, carbs. I'm going to have to walk later. Well, I did walk to the store and back, but I'm going to have to do it again. <laughs> Where's my straw? Ugh, I have to wash my straws. I keep my straws for only a limited amount of time. I wash them, boil them, put them in hot water, clean them. Then after a while, I toss them out. I heard that they're going to discontinue making straws. But online, like I mentioned in one of my other videos, they're selling bamboo straws. I hope those don't run out because I want to order me some. I'm getting like a whole bunch and stick them in my utensil jar. Did I say? Yeah, utensils. Yeah, I said it right. <laughs> Brain fart. <laughs> And, you know, wash them, wash them, and you can reuse them and reuse them. And it's wood. It's made from bamboo. So you can stick it in a boiling pot of water and clean it and disinfect it and reuse it over and over again. I'm sorry. Am I not showing you my food that I can barely finish? Whew. Oh, that's so good. Don't spill it now. I think I'm just going to finish the uh, hmm, sandwich and save cinnamon bun for later. Hmm. Hmm. I'm sorry, is it not focusing? How's that? Is that better? Sure, you can have a bite. Here you go. Mm. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't mean to tease you. Mm. 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 My artistic talent here. Out of my old guitar case, I made this awesome shelf for pictures. Ow, I don't know if you can see that. Put teddy bear on there. Isn't that cute? And then behind me, I just whacked my face with my laptop. Ow! behind me I used the cover to pin up cards and little phil philosophical quotes let's see which philosophical quote I got on here is one of my favorite quotes which got all turned over here oops there goes my birthday card all right this philosophical quote it says never by hatred is hatred appeased but it is appeased by kindness this is an eternal truth that was written by Buddha. Yeah, baby. You know I like my philosophical quotes, right? And you're, are y'all digging my little bear back there and my bunny? Look at my bunny. <laughs> Look at my ferocious looking bear. They keep me company. They protect me. Just like Jesus. See my Jesus picture? Y'all see my stuff in my room. I'm always recording in here. I don't like to eat in my room because they say it brings bugs. I don't have a bug problem at my house because I keep it pretty clean. Just as long as you remember to sweep after you eat. Because even if you don't see the crumbs, they're there somewhere. <gasps> oh, excuse me. If not my little kitten, I call him a little mini vac. <laughs> He's a, my little mini vac. He's a little vacuum cleaner. He'll just <sighs> eat it all off my floor. I don't even have to sweep half the time because he eats everything off the floor. <laughs> That's gross. I keep my floors clean, don't worry. My kitten is getting so big, I need to get him um, fixed soon because I don't want him spraying my house. Oh my god. He is so hyperactive. I think he has ADD or something. He needs Ritalin. I don't know what his problem is. Um, and no offense to y'all who do have that condition, but I seriously think my cat has some kind of hyper disorder 
mental thing going on. <laughs> my dad's like, he's a kitten. They like to play. My mom says the same thing. When he bothers you too much, just throw a toy and he'll fetch it, which is true. But then he comes back and he jumps on my lap and he wants to eat my food or he wants to play. I guess it's just been a while since I had a baby in the house, you know, a little kitten. But when Zimba, when Zimbalaya, let me get a picture of Zimbalaya here. I show you a picture because he's he's in the living room right now. I can't, I cannot let these cats in my room, and they will take over the show. Once in a while, I like to put them on my vlogs. This is Zimba. That's my baby Zimbalaya, and that's me looking all cool with my hat. That's a, a awesome filter I found on on an app, and I wasn't much dinner than I am now. I'm just really good at taking pictures. You know the angle. Face the, face the camera up above you and it makes you look thinner. Yeah, baby. You see, it works. So, this is not even that long ago, this picture. Okay? And then I look so pale because of the filter. I like the way the eyelashes look. Check out those eyelashes. That's all a filter. And I made my eyes look like a navy blue. Isn't that cool? All a filter. I even changed my eyebrows. Filter, baby. I look like 20 years younger in this picture. Filters are magical. But look, I got no filters right now, no makeup on, I have no wrinkles, no age spots. I take care of myself. I go out in the sun, I wear protection, and I use my Anu every morning, and I use my Mary Kay at night, so that's right. What? <laughs> so that's my baby Zimba. And he's in some of my videos, so I guess that's about it, guys. I don't know if I'm going to finish this. Oh, good Lord. Because I'm already getting full. Oh, but mm. Our little Debbie, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so good. Ah, oh, what the hell? Mm. Yeah, I need to tell me what you're up to. It was um a fellow YouTuber's birthday yesterday, and I swung by and said happy birthday. Shout out to Tiki. Tiki! <laughs> Crazy ass. She has some awesome lights behind her. I need to ask her where she got them lights. I need to get me some. Get my party on. Maybe have a rave up on my channel. Hey! Invite y'all over. Mmm. So I stopped by. And I was blowing up her chat. I was like, hey, happy birthday. Hey, love you like that. <laughs> it was fun. And it was late. It was after 12.30. And I was just ready to crash. So I was like, feeling old over here. When I'm tired. Because once I take my meds, the longest I can stay up past my meds is an hour or two max. And then that's it. I'm deteriorating. Like, ugh, I can't keep my eyes open. My blood pressure pills knock me out. They make me so tired. And I can fight to sleep. And then I'll be talking to you and my eyes are closed and I'll be passed out. You'll be like, Cindy? Cindy, hello. <laughs> I can't even go out. Because if I go out, it's going to happen. That's dangerous. You know? That's another reason probably it wouldn't be a good idea for me to play out in a rock band right now. Until my med situation gets situated. I take three different types of meds for my blood pressure because not just is my blood pressure high my heart rate is also high so they're trying to control both the <clears throat> cyalostic and dialostic as well as my heart rate my heart rate is like to the roof and if I don't take these three different types of medication <coughs> bye bye no more fatal beauty channel it'll be my kitten angel blue and uh, Zimba miracle taking over and all they'll be doing is making a mess and tearing up everything. <laughs> That's pretty much what it'll be. So, yeah, it is what it is. I wish there was a med that 
a prescription that I can take that wouldn't make me so tired so that I can go out, go to a movie, go to a late dinner, play out in a band without getting tired halfway through. It'd be really cool, you know, it'd be awesome. Lord Jesus, if you can just fix my blood pressure, <laughs> take it away, the problem, then I won't need meds anymore. Oh well. Mmm. 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 I got like a little crunchy piece of strawberry. Like the seeds. Pretty good. <sighs> so we're coming towards the end of the sandwich here. And of my vlog. If you're new to my channel, welcome! Yes, I'm a goofball. <laughs> yes, I rant and rave sometimes. Yes, I dabble into a little bit of everything on YouTube. But that's what Fatal Beauty is about. I'm not afraid to try anything, baby. That's right. So if you're new, guys, hello. Welcome to my Fatal Beauty channel. Please remember to like and subscribe, please course if you want no pressure come on you know you wanna invite your friends share share cuz the more the merrier okay you know you wanna come on 